So in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to make an intro animation, an intro video inside Premiere Pro. And I'm also going to give you an intro video template for free. Check this out. Okay, so I'm gonna give you the template and also the included sound effects. If you don't know me yet, my name is Silarch from bluefx.net and we create video templates. If you already like the template that you're seeing, make sure that you hit the like button and also subscribe to this channel because when we release new templates, you don't wanna miss them. Now, let's start and let's, let me show you exactly how you can edit this project, how you can create an intro video, even if you're a complete beginner inside Premiere Pro. So the first step is to download the template. All you got to do is to click on the link in this video's description. It's in the bottom of this video. And once you unzip that project, you're going to find a project named Universal. Okay, open that up and there you're going to find a lot of cool files. Select all of them, drag and drop them to your timeline inside Premiere Pro. Actually to your project panel here. Okay. Now we have imported our footage and let's start creating. Now you have here something called a background. You just drag this background to your timeline, boom, like that. The next step, the next thing that you want to add is one of the animations. We have included multiple colors. We're going to use now the blue color just because it goes well with our logo. Now let's preview this. Okay. So this is the animation. Now, another thing that you can add here is obviously your logo. So we're going to add our own logo. I'm going to import the logo of BlueFX here. Boom. Let's drag and drop it to our timeline. Okay. And what you want to do is you want to put your logo below, underneath the animation layer. Okay. So let's take the time. Let, let's find the perfect time. Okay, this is the time where uh, the ribbon is covering the screen. Okay, so here I'm going to put my logo animation. My logo should start here. Now, obviously, I'm going to turn off the top layer a little bit. Now, obviously, you can see this logo is way too big. So we got to scale this down. So let's scale this down like this. I'm scaling it down. Okay. Now it disappeared. Let's see if this looks good. It looks good. And we could say. We could say we already have a cool looking logo animation, but I want to show you how to make this even better. Now we have included a layer called lens flare. Okay, here you got to find the flare. Now we're going to drag and drop this and just start it from the beginning, Be from the beginning of your timeline that your project you're gonna add this here so all of these lines all of the, you have the animation and the lens flare aligned at the start okay now as you can see this is not really looking good because we have a black background on the animation so for that all you got to do is go to your logo animation lens flare click on that that video file and then you have your effects. You got to go to your effects and go to opacity. If this is closed, just throw it down like this opacity. And here you have something called the blending mode. Okay. To open this up and just click on select the screen blending mode and bala da da. The black background disappeared. Let's take a look. And as you can see, we have here the lens flare moving. It, it gives it an extra, it, it makes it look better, simply. Okay, and the next step that I wanna add is I wanna add a text. I wanna add a nice subtitle, okay? So how do we do that? Well, in Premiere Pro, all you gotta do is go to graphics, new layer, and text. Now, once you do that, a new layer will appear. We're going to change this up, but first let's type in some text. Okay. Very inspirational. So go to bluefx.net to get cool templates. I wonder why I use this phrase. I also want to change the color. So for that, you select the text 
and go to the settings panel, the effects panel here, and let's start with the color. Now the color I like to I don't I like to use obviously a color that has enough contrast so that people can read it, but the idea is that if you make it just a little bit closer to gray and not just that dark black, then it will look it will look smoother to the eyes when uh, when you have contrast but not that super harsh contrast. Okay, so let's just make it something like this. Uh, a darkish gray. Okay, now let's make the font different. Let me show you a cool font. It's called Roboto. I like to use this one. It has a cool name and it looks good. So I'm gonna use Roboto regular. Okay, let's make this one smaller. We making we make the text smaller like this. Okay, that's gonna look good. And now we gotta reposition it again to the middle okay I think we have something now let me show you another trick if you listen to the audio you will hear that there's a bell sound right about here right about here the bell sound okay now oh here's the bell the bell starts around this this Part. So what we want is we want the logo animation to, I mean the text to appear exactly on the bell. That will give a nice effect to it. But I also want to add a um, fade in effect. Now, super simple setup in Premiere Pro to add a fade in. Let me show you. Hold down Control and push D. Control D. And that will automatically add a cross dissolve effect. And we're gonna have a cross dissolve effect at the start of the layer and also at the end of the layer. But we only need it at the start of the layer. Okay, I'm gonna delete it from the end of the layer by selecting it and cl clicking on delete. And next, I'm gonna make this cross dissolve a little bit uh, faster. And now, and now, and now, and now it's time to watch, to check what we've done. Perfect. And that's it. This is how you make an intro animation, an intro video inside Premiere Pro. Okay, so if you enjoyed this video, please make sure that you click on that subscribe button and on that like button because I very much appreciate it. And if you have a feedback from me, or if you just like this video, or if you don't like this video, yeah, just, just write a comment. It's very important. The gods of YouTube, I heard that they, they, they favor the videos if they have a lot of comments. Okay, now the idea is that if you don't have this uh, this logo animation again, click on the description. There's a link in the description and you can check that out. I'm also gonna link to another video. I'm also gonna link to another template that is a premium template that comes with 10 animated logo animations. Okay, so here's one for free and we can uh, have, we, we also offer um, paid version that comes with 10 different logo animations. Okay, so thanks very much for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.